Brian, uh, obviously you're you're very high on Dracovic. I'm just curious, do you think he has the ability at this point to, to challenge for the starting job right out of the gate in August? I want him to challenge. Yeah, I want Brandon to feel uh, competition. Um, and I'm sure Brandon wants to be challenged. And, and any great competitor wants that uh, feeling that somebody's pushing him every day. And, and not that um, Ian doesn't, Ian Book doesn't, but, you know, let's bring in another really good quarterback, a, a great quarterback. That's, that's our job here at Notre Dame. And um, I'm not doing a good enough job if I don't bring in a great quarterback to challenge the incumbent quarterback. And if, if that threatens Brandon, then, then he's not the guy I think he is. Um, I'm pretty certain he's going to be excited about um, uh, Phil being here in, in the competition. What, what about him as a sophomore really put him on the radar for you? Um, first of all, the, the reviews about him uh, leading his team as a sophomore um, and, and, and at his age. He wasn't, he wasn't a sophomore that was held back. Uh, he was a young sophomore. Uh, that was out there leading his football team against really good competition. And so th that, that was something that we needed to go see. Presence, leadership ability, um, you know, you got to go see that in person. How he interacts with his teammates when he comes back on the sideline. So to see that as a sophomore, um, it, it was important for us in this recruiting process of making decisions on quarterbacks that I needed to know more about his makeup. And, and that gave us the first glimpse of who he was and what his makeup was. And the fact that he was such an accomplished basketball player and so dedicated to that and, and seemed to have long seasons because they were pretty good, I mean, is that a positive in your, your mind or would you have rather him focus more on football stuff? No, I'm, I'm, I'm of the opposite um, spectrum in that I love guys playing another sport, competing. You can't, you know, there's nothing that can replace um, uh, the, the ability to lead and the ability to compete um, that another sport gives you. Um, and when I got a chance to go watch him play basketball, just his – his drive, his competitiveness, his interaction with his teammates, his, um, th those things you can't, you can't get in the gym, you know. Yeah, you can get a little bit stronger. Um, certainly you can continue to throw and build relationships in one-on-one, -on -one, but you can't get those traits that separate the good from the great.